Pancho Vera staying very responsible for transforming Rafael Marquez into an excellent boxer. We already knew he had the power, but now he's able to combine those those two key elements. You Round know, three. We thought this fight would turn on who makes either the first mistakes or the most mistakes. And right now, for Vasquez, part of the reason he's getting hit with those right hands is one of the keys, his jab's a little lazy and his, le right, his left hand's a little bit low, and Marquez is able to get his right hand in. And Marquez's punches, not only dangerous, but they're, they're slashing type punches. And, and they often cause or can exacerbate cuts. Just ask Silence Mabuza. Vasquez was in a very good rhythm for the first part of round one, but hasn't been since then. He's Mar been slowed by yeah. the punching power of, of Rafael Marquez. Now right in there on the inside, Vasquez was able to get the right handed, but hasn't been able to uncoil the left hook when he's in there. He needs that punch even more than Marquez. Marquez with a heavy right, it sent Vasquez back. Oh, did that get Vasquez's attention? Now a left hook to the jaw. Whoa. And down goes Marquez! Vasquez knocks yes. Marquez down! with a minute 14 remaining. And sustained non-stop two-way action. Just when it looked like Marquez was having his way, down he went. And he's got a minute to go. Vasquez, oh Vasquez is now uncalling that left hook and that's what made the difference. He was able to get that punch off. Both these guys have tasted the canvas before. Both usually come back with renewed vigor. They prosper from adversity. We'll see how, how it affects Marquez. Vasquez has not been wild in his attack. He has been cautious. He knows Marquez is dangerous. He doesn't oh. want to let the moment pass. A lot he... of folks wouldn't be surprised now if Vasquez <laughs> went down. Box. 20 seconds left in the third round. It is as advertised. Most of the fans here at the Home Depot Center standing. As we head for the bell in a breakthrough round for Israel Vasquez. Rafael Marquez got off to a very good start in the third round. Ripping the uppercuts, good combinations by Marquez, and so and even hurt Vasquez there with that right hand. So it looked like Marquez had things well in hand. However, that left hook on the inside changed the round. As we know, and you've pointed out, those left hooks can from Vasquez.